What's up guys, Shane Stars here with Droid Motor X. As you know, mobile data is a hot commodity. AT&T just announced that they're bringing back an unlimited data plan. And their unlimited data plan is actually pretty affordable. For $180, you can have four lines with unlimited talk, text, and data. Now it was rumored that Verizon might be bringing back unlimited data and Verizon was quick to announce that any rumors of such were nonsense that they would not be bringing back unlimited data. If you happen to be on a tiered data or family share plan with Verizon or any other network, you're probably always looking for ways to save data. In this video, I'm gonna show you a quick and simple way to cut your data in half when viewing YouTube, Netflix, or any other video streaming services. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so basically what you wanna do is head to the Play Store and you're looking for an application called Opera Max. So this is by the same guys that brought us the Opera browser. So it actually tells you in the title of the application what it does. You'll download that, it's free from the Play Store and then you'll open it up. Okay, and you can actually turn it on for the apps or turn it off. So essentially what you would do is find the application, say YouTube, and you can either turn it on or off. So basically what this is, is like a browser extension, but it works alongside the YouTube app, the Netflix app, and your browser, your Twitter feed, your Facebook feed. What it does is it compresses the videos. So when you're downloading the videos, they're being downloaded in a compressed form and it really saves you data. So basically it cuts your data consumption in half, which is great for anyone on a shared data plan. Yeah, I turned it off today while I was using it today. The reason for that is when it compresses the file, it brings you down to about a 380p video. So it's kind of a low quality video. It's still usable. So if you're really needing to pinch and save your data, uh, say you're getting to the end of your month and maybe you only have like 500 megabytes left, but there's a video you really wanna watch, um, this is a great way to save data. Or if you just love to watch video all month long and the quality is not the biggest deal to you, then this would be a great app for you to save data during the month. You can watch double the videos on YouTube or double the videos on Netflix. So as you guys can see, I actually consumed 179 megabytes of mobile data from the YouTube application. I actually saved 187 megabytes, so I saved more than half on my data. So this is data that I didn't have to use, that I would have had to use. This is data that I actually used. More than half of my data was saved for the day of Wednesday on YouTube. So basically if you go over to the left, it'll actually show you your monthly savings. I've only been using it for two days here. Uh, so as you guys can see, I've saved about 500 megabytes for the month, but the savings, they really add up. And where you're gonna see most of your savings is in YouTube or Netflix, even in Facebook. So if you're watching a lot of video in the Facebook application, you'll see huge savings here with this app. If you're watching a ton of video in the Twitter app, you'll also see uh, really big savings in the app as well. Anyways, guys, that about wraps it up for this video. If you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. You can find more of me at droidmotorx.com. Follow me on Twitter at droidmotorx. Thanks, guys, for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.